So, what about Lane? Okay, my. Yes, you are uh, close. Yes, to the right. Lane, do you hear me? Yes. Yes. Yes, so length, no, length is too much then. So length uh, 6 to 8 centimeters. And uh, wide from. Like it, remember. Okay, next question rapidly. Method of determining the patency of the respiratory tract of the victim. Uh, we need to determine whether the patient is breathing or not. Is that yes. what the question is asking? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we can listen to his breathing by watching his thoracic. No, first we need to like uh, check his airway if he's breathing uh -huh. or not. So we need to bring our face close to his mouth uh, and yes. like put our head on the onto the side and bring our cheeks near to his mouth to see if mm. it's there is. Breathing or not? Count. Mm -hmm. So 10. 1, 2, two, 10. Mm -hmm. uh, and then, yeah, well, first airway, then breathing, then we need to check his circulation. Mm -hmm. So, how would name ABC? Peter Safars, yes? Safars, ABC. Okay, then. Um, if no breathing, no questions. CPR. CPR. Okay. What the ratio of CPR? Uh, thirty-two. No, that's uh, for bigger. Uh, adults. fifteen. Fifteen to. Fifteen to two for teenagers. For young, younger children, I think. Like children less than one year, three, three is to one, because we need to yeah, check more, to more, mm -hmm. more airway for more breathing. Mm -hmm. breathing. Okay. Younger. Okay. Okay. We did at the uh, presentation, but you are right. Okay, very good. Because we have no more time. This. What is this? Measles. Measles, yes. Uh, for the number one, what is you what is you Complex like? spots. Yes, complex, complex spots. Then number mm -hmm. two. Mm. Is it a rash? Yes, rash. Yes, and the face, and the first days of the mm, rash. Yes. So number three, what do you think? Look at his eyes. Yeah, it is. What? Like it's swollen. Over? No so I think uh, that it is photophobia, yes? Yes. Ah, Why it is also good. Yes, for B and the measles, yes. Then number four and five, no, just we can see uh, a skin rash, yes? Mm -hmm. At the body. So tell me please the features of the uh, skin rash at the measles. Yes, it is a part like appearance. When, what? appearance in the fourth day after the fever. Yes, 
No. It's on difficulty. Mm. Yes. For, for, the th okay. for three days. For the first day, it is from days. the skull. Yeah, for three days. Mm. Yes, okay. This analysis, analysis. Ah. Um, here we need to, like, there is certain index for this for example for leukocyte it should be i think in one milliliter to two thousand and erythrocyte should be one thousand in one milliliter yes, yes. This that is hematuria. what is this yeah this is hematuria hematuria yes erythrocyte urea or hematuria uh what uh condition or disease it can be Nephritic syndrome, glomerulonephritis. Yes. Nephritic syndrome or uh, glomerulonephritis. Okay, very good. Next. Let's go to the next. This is deep palpation of abdomen. Yes, deep palpation of abdomen. Palpation for mm -hmm. mm. Yes, perform a cardiopulmonary resuscitation in a new body. Uh, this one we have to use finger. Mm -hmm. uh, we we need to use one thumb finger. We should place it on on top of another thumb finger, not side to side, but like on top of each other. Mm -hmm. uh, and then we need to compress about one point five centimeters deep. Mm -hmm. uh, three to two. Uh, three, three to one. Two. Three to one. Yes. Three, to one. three compression, one breath. Yes. Very good. Okay, this. Uh, For the first, uh, it is ecchymosis. Yes, ecchymosis. Ecchymosis and then um, on the mucous membrane, hemorrhages of the mucous membrane, yes? Yes. The mucous membrane of the mouth, of the tongue, the lips. Mm -hmm. So what it can be? One will brain factor disease. Also, glands may be disease. Yes, very good. Very good. Okay, next. Zimnitsky. <laughs> What is the goal of the test, urine test by Zimnitsky? To detect the excretory function of the kidney. Excretory? No, not excretory. To check the diuresis and the uh, relative no, density. Also, yes, relative density. So, what connection uh, with related density and one function of the kidneys? What function? Uh, yes, daily diuresis is also important. But what function of the kidneys we have to we want to uh, evaluate? using this test what do we absorption no no concentrated, diuresis. concentrated function yes concentrating 
function case, yes. Concentrating function on the kidneys. So please look at this analysis. Second look. Uh, this boy is 12 years old. So, so also this patient have the polyuria. No, we use yes. the formula. Yeah. We use the formula. One, one, 60 plus 100 and minus 1. 600 plus 100 into yes. N1. You are right. So, of course, this is polyuria. And then, uh, what about ratio uh, day and night diuresis? Between day and night diuresis. <clears throat> polyuria and nicturia. Remember them. Look at the relative density. I think it is low because it should be about yeah. 12 to 15, I think, in between. Yeah. The difference between them. Yeah. The highest yeah. one. So look, at first, uh, we see that the relative density is not changing uh, during the day, yes? Because uh -huh. the difference between maximum and minimum uh, meanings uh, should be uh, not less than 10 to 12. Mm -hmm. So, for example, uh, let's find the maximum uh, meaning of the relative density. Uh, it is uh, 1010. Yes, 10. Uh, and uh, the minimum? The low minimum three. Uh, 1003. 3. So the difference is only 7. Uh, seven. It, yes, 7 less than 10, less than 12. So we can say that uh, uh, this is oligo pulgo, iso gipo, uh, iso hipo stenuria. Hipostenolia. Yeah, hipostenolia. Yeah, hipostenuria. Uh -huh. Iso, that means uh, the same, yes? Iso, hippo, and yeah. So we can see the same low. Um, meaning of the relative density during the day. And that means that the kidneys, uh, the, that the concentrating function of the kidneys is uh, damaged, yes? Okay. Is violent. Uh, Violated, yes, is violated. <laughs> Kidneys cannot concentrate the urea. But look at the uh, one more time at the D diuresis. In what disease we can um, see these changes? Diabetes mellitus. Yes, diabetes myelitis and also uh, non myelitis, yes? Diabetes myelitis. Yes, African diabetes. Uh -huh. Okay, very good. Next. This checking for uh, gold bladder, gold bladder. 
This is coastal arch, yes? Look, doctors, this is right coastal arch. Okay, and this is abdomen area. So at the photo number one, what we can see? Uh, morphe sign. Normal should be this. Morphe sign. Uh, Murphy, yes, Murphy sign. sign. This. Pharyngeus sign like this. Pharyngeus, yes. Yeah. Pharyngeus sign and this. This is like ultra like. Ordinary. Retina, yeah. yeah. Um, very good ordinary sign, very good. Ratio in children over one year. Fifteen to two? Mm -hmm. Fifteen to two. This rapidly. This is not difficult. Jaundice. Jaundice. Yes, jaundice. Neonatal, yes, jaundice. Uh-huh. Then this. Hi, ah, this is high leukocytes. Yes, high leukocytes. Leukocyturia, so uh, yes. maybe infection of the urinary tract. Yes, urinary tract infection. What like infection we can suppose, yes? Cytitis and the bilinephritis. And the pilinephritis, but we don't know, yes? We have to yes. do ultrasound yes yeah. okay very good very good and another doc another doctors why do you need work okay next Is uh, percussion of the abdomen? Uh, yes, this is percussion Blood. of abdomen for what? Bladder. Yeah, uh, not appendix, bladder. Yes, urinary bladder, but urinary bladder. This is palpation of the or palpation, percussion of the urinary bladder. So tell me. Uh, up to what years the urinary bladder can uh, protrude uh, under the uh, pubis? Up to two years? Yes, very good. Up to two years. Very good. Very good. Ratio uh, in teenager, rapidly teenager. Fifteen to one. Yes, thirty-two. Thirty-two. Two. Two. Okay. This. Oh, no. This is mom's. Mom. Mom's. Yes, mom's. And what glands uh, are damaged? Glands are damaged. Parad very good very good one more time Zeniski. this girl is eight years old so 600 plus 700 104 uh, oh, 1400 should be the normal mm -hmm. diaries it's less mm -hmm. so but it's normal. Number H, it's normal. Yes, daily diuresis and relative density. Normal, I think. Also normal, yes. Because yes, yes. we can see, yes, a high difference between the maximum and the minimum, yes. Uh, mm. Meaning 
between meanings on the relative density between the day. Yes, this is normal. Let's go rapidly. Yes. Mm -hmm. This? Uh, the question of the... The question of the land, I think. No. Uh, I think uh, of the heart, of the heart, of the heart. The heart of the heart. Now uh, we will stop at this question, but please uh, read the normal borders of the heart, of the relate, rel related... Uh, Points. Downness, yes, related downness of the heart. Okay, read it. Then, what are the what? This question. Ah, you passed it, yes? Ah, no. Number three. Uh, uh, this is when the patient is freezing but is unconscious. We use this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Also, but breathing normally. Uh -huh. And. Uh, <laughs> And to prevent what? him from uh, choking on his vomit. Mm -hmm. Look, uh, and the heart rate is normal. Yeah. Uh, who are talking now? Heart. Heart. Look, uh, for tomorrow, uh, please, you have to do some. Um, with your microphone because your sound is not so good. I think it uh, could be problems on the practical skills. Okay, please. Okay. Mom, so, yes, of course. Mm. This, Nichiparienko. This is normal, I think, normal. Yes, yes. Normal. normal. And what is uh, the goal of the urine test uh, by nature plan? It's to check conditions like uh, hematuria or leuke leukocyturia. So, so clarify the changes, yes? For example, if in the urinalysis, uh, urinalysis, we see that, for example, leukocytes uh, 100, yes, uh, we can see 100. So we are understanding that uh, this patient have leukocyte here, and we don't need yes nature parenchyma test for what we know that you know, this patient have leukocyte here. But sometimes, uh, for example, uh, we receive the analysis with uh, leukocytes uh, ten to uh, fifteen, yes. 
So this is uh, more than normal years, but uh, we don't say what is this. Yes, it's too uh, mm. obscure. It's too it's hard to test. Yes, yeah. it's hard to diagnose. So to clarify the changes we were doing uh, the nutrient test. In one milliliter, yes, we will see a uh, little size, a little size in one milliliter of the urine. Okay, next. Physical methods for detection of ascites. Percussion. Yes, percussion. Yes, percussion. Yes. The methods, please read at the book, okay? So, methods of determining consequent or uh, consciousness of the What? Consciousness. Mm -hmm. Consciousness. Uh, responsiveness uh, to stimulus. Uh, what? By shaking the victim. Mm -hmm. Response to stimulus. Uh, shake of the victim. Uh, uh, then then okay. ask loudly. Ask loudly. Are you okay? In Loudly. The, in each in year. Two year. Yes. In each yes. year. Yeah. Yes. In, two, in which year? Very good. This. What is this? The, the first and the third the picture is Edeme. Yeah, maybe Edeme. Third one is. The first one, Purpura. Purpura. Second one. Yes. Yes, mm -hmm. shoreline, geno, purpura, or uh, hemorrhagic vasculitis, yes? It is. Mm -hmm. Yes, or, so, so this is hemorrhagic skin elements, yes, purpura, or shoreline, geno, very good, great, then this, a biochemical uh, blood test. Mm. Well, mm. open the crease, yeah, the crease. Also, the ALT and mm -hmm. AST increase. So maybe this mm -hmm. patient have hepatitis. Hepatitis, yes. And what symptoms are jaundice? Uh, during just we can see only at the skin, but we don't see the patient. What laboratory see them? Yes, I I think uh, this patient uh, have the jaundice. You are right, but um, according their analysis, AST, AD. Part. I'm sorry. I don't know if. Uh, your friends hear you, but I don't hear you well. Um, it could be cholestasis. Cholestatic stasis. Mm. Yes. And? Mm -hmm. LTST. Look, lactate, dehydrogenase also uh, increase. AD, 
I will get a window transfer is is very high. And I'll put time for switches level, sir. Are also abnormally high. Also, alkaline phosphate is in the case. So what um, this syndrome? Cytolysis also, yes? Cytolysis. Yes. Uh, I could not remember the syndrome. Cytolysis. Cytolysis, very good. Next, rapidly, rapidly. What does the doctor check in the child? Importance of the lung. Yes, lung yes, percussion. Yes, yes, yes. Lung percussion. Uh, topographic, yes, lung percussion. Mm. Topographical. Uh, first aid when aspiration of a foreign body in a five year baby. Mm -hmm. Is the, um, what? Hemorrhage method. Hemorrhage method. Yeah, method. Okay. Then this. Scarlet fever. Yes. Uh, no scarlet fever. No scarlet fever. <laughs> So this is babies, yes? Babies younger than one year so with disclamation, with excoriation on, on the cheek.